the power of silence guys today i want us to talk about si the power of silence this means there are moments which you need to be silent in some cases so if you talk much you might irritate people so you cannot take back words that you've said so you better be silent than saying something which will hurt you later so you better be silent so we have uh, 22 moments when to be silent this means there are some situations which will force you to be silent one be silent in the heat of hunger this means when someone hugs with you and someone maybe someone is in hunger you better be silent because that hunger can cause something else so if someone is in hunger with you be silent because it can cause something bad another thing is be silent when you don't have necessary facts this means you don't have to talk much if you do not the truth about if you do not know the truth about something you better be silent because you might say something that is not true and some people may be knowing the truth about that thing and you talk too much so you better be silent another thing is be silent when you have not verified the story in this case there are those people who are storytellers they tell stories of people from one person to another so if you don't know the real story if you have not verified the story so please you better be silent and then another thing is be silent when it's time to listen in some cases you have um, when you are talking with people you should not be the one to talk all the time maybe you are many so there is that you so you better give another person time to talk you be silent when other people are talking when it's your time to talk you can talk and then another thing be silent when you ask a question maybe you've asked a question and then you want to talk again and you've asked so you better be silent to wait for the answer another thing is be silent if your words will convey the wrong impression if you feel that if you talk what you will talk will not be uh, give a good impression to others so you better be silent on that matter another thing is be silent if your words will offend a weaker person maybe you are somewhere with people and then you are talking so if you see that what you are going to talk will offend another person you better be silent and then um, be silent if you will be ashamed of your words later you know sometimes we talk much and then later you go and say i, I am ashamed maybe you, you say something that will give you shame some other time so you better be silent if you see that what you will say will give you shame later and then be silent when your responses are hard a waste of time this means um you might talk things that you will see that you have just wasted your time and you've talked nothing so you better be silent in that case another thing is be silent if your words will damage someone's reputation for this reason uh, if you know that if you talk if you see that what you say will damage someone's reputation so you better be silent another thing is be silent if the issue is none of your business maybe you are with people and people are talking their things so you don't interfere if it's none of your business you just be, you just listen and be silent you don't have to interfere people when they are talking their businesses and it's none of your business and then be silent if your words will damage a friendship in this case it means that if you talk and you see that what you will say will damage your friendship or the other people's friendship you know in this case maybe you are the person you are talking to you will damage your friendship or else if you are talking to someone in, uh, about someone that talk will damage the friendship between the two so you better be silent and then again uh, be silent if you are feeling critical in this case if you are feeling uh, vulnerable you better be silent <laughs> Another thing is be silent if you <coughs> can't say <coughs> Okay another thing is be silent if you can't say it without screaming this means that if this thing is really pressing you say so that you cannot say it slowly you feel like screaming you better be silent and then be silent if you are feeling critical this one means that 
if you feel that the information you are holding is sensitive you better be silent and then be silent if you may have to hit if you may have to hit your words later in this case it means that if you feel that what you say you will regret later you will feel that let me swallow these words and <laughs> once you've said it's not swallowable you will regret forever so you better be silent than saying things that will hurt you later and then be silent if you have if you have said that thing more than once if you had said that thing twice or thrice you better be silent because you've seen that there is no one who listens to you so you better be silent on that matter you don't have to repeat yourself over and over again and then be silent if you have nothing to say in this case it means that maybe you are with people and you don't have a genuine um point to make so if you don't have a genuine point to make so don't talk any howly you better be silent and then <clears throat> be silent if it's better left and said um, in this case it means that there are those words which will make you regret later maybe these words were not meant to be said publicly so you better be silent than saying it and then you will say later why did i say this and then uh, be silent when you are about to flatter a bad person in this case it means that when you are about um, maybe you are talking with someone and maybe this person have bad character maybe he might fight you he might fight you or other people are hot tempered so if you know that you want to talk to someone who is hot tempered so you better be silent and talking and then later you will regret maybe you'll be beaten or something else will happen so you better be silent and then uh, be silent to avoid unnecessary arguments uh, in this case <coughs> it means that when you feel that maybe your words might inflict um argument unnecessary argument you better be silent and then be silent when you have feelings that the words will hurt in this case it means that uh, when you feel that what you are about to say with, will hurt someone you better be silent that end up hurting somebody now as we come to the hand be silent if it will land you in trouble in this uh, case maybe you said something you told someone and then someone goes and tells someone and then again maybe it will lead to cases and then you will be called and then you will be asked to say the, the the root cause of the word so you better be silent if you are not sure because it might uh, end you in trouble and then be silent in the heat of an argument in this case when you are arguing with someone and you are seeing that this person is really high you better be silent so guys okay guys we've come to the end of um our 22 moments when to be silent i've given you 22 points on when to be silent silence is golden so when you are silent you will avoid a lot of arguments you will avoid troubles and you will avoid problems so when you are silent it boosts your integrity so guys you can hard there are some a time when you have to be silent and maybe i have not had it here so please give us down there in the comments below and so guys please subscribe to my youtube channel and continue watching my videos as i will be uploading a video each and every day so please subscribe until next time bye